Hey guys, um, I'm super excited today to share with you my garage sale haul. Me and my husband are out garage selling all morning and I wanna show you guys what I got because I know that you love watching these hauls. So let's get started. First off, I found this Ed Hardy Tattooing Zip Up Black Hoodie. It's a really thin, stretchy material. Um, really cute, I love, love, love this brand. Um, here's the back, super cute. That was $3, really good find, I love that one. Next, I found this really cute tank top. Um, kind of a different design, that's why it kind of caught my eye. Looks like this. Really cute. Um, that was a dollar. And then I got this beautiful dress. Let me just... Okay. Ah, sorry. Sorry, guys. I have to get it up so you guys can see it. Okay, it looks like this. Really beautiful pattern. Really silky and flowy. This was $3 as well. I love the pattern. This is a really nice color for summer and fall. So that's that. And then I got this really cute tank top. Kind of a braided kind of thing with a chain braided in it. This is the Day Trip brand. I really like that brand. Kind of has an elastic band at the waist so you can kind of um, fluff it out if you want or let it slouch. So that is that one. That was two dollars. Then I got these plaid Bermuda shorts for a dollar. I thought they were cute, comfortable. Then down here we have the really excited stuff that I'm super excited to share with you. First off, I got this beautiful leather purse. It's like in excellent condition. Super huge in the inside. You guys can see it looks brand new. Um, let me see the brand here. This is the Croft and Barrel brand, which is really nice. Um, really nice brand. Like this purse doesn't even look used. It has a bunch of different fun compartments inside. Um, and you can hook this to the other side, I believe, to make it more slouchy, I think, or keep it more like making sure everything's not going to fall out. I don't know how to explain that, but there's that. That was $2, and I'm going to give this to a special somebody for Christmas. I'm not going to say who, so it's going to be a surprise. So yeah, I thought that was a really good find. It's like brand new. Okay, then my favorite find of the day was this. I'm not really familiar with this brand, sorry. Um, Dooney and Burke purse. Um, I know these are really high end. I got this at like a mansion garage sale. The girl said it was real. Um, I paid $15. She wouldn't take 10. But I was looking online on eBay and they're at least going for 100 bucks used. And it comes with the matching kind of wallet kind of purse inside of it. This is real leather. It feels so nice and smooth. Um, if you guys can see the inside, it is a really deep purse, but there is some staining. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, there's some staining in there. But I'm going to try to clean that out. I really like that purse. I don't think I'm going to sell it yet um, because I really, really like the colors and everything. It's kind of a mutual color to match everything and super fancy. So I really love that purse. Let me know if you guys know anything about that brand. Like, is it a higher end than Coach? Or what do you guys know? Let me know. I'm super excited to find out. Then I bought these bags of Christmas bows. Um, I'm super into Christmas stuff. I'm having, like, huge Christmas parties this year. On my husband's side and my side as well. So 25 cents a bag for these really nice condition bows is cheap. Because I'm not going to find those 25 cents on clearance before Christmas. So I need to find as many as I can. So, then I found this set of koozies. Like, there's at least 10 in here. For 50 cents, they all look pretty new condition. And then, I found these two puzzles for a dollar each. Me and my mother-in-law enjoy putting these together. So, that would be fun. Oh, 
that's just the bag. Um, I thought this was funny because the lady at the garage sale was like, ooh, you get the hot bag. And I'm thinking, wow, that bag looks old, like years old, doesn't it? <sighs> okay. Then I found these really cute stickers to put on my Christmas party invitations this year. Um, for 25 cents for this whole thing of them. Oh, cute. That's really cute. And then I found this um, brand new body source. What's it say? Nectar Bath, Bath and Shower Gel. And this was a dollar. I really love bath and shower stuff. I use it so quickly. I don't know why. Okay. And then I got this really nice tablecloth. Um, this is a really nice fabric. And it's going to fit over my huge table. Um, I'm used to buying those cheap like vinyl, rippy, plasticky ones, but this is actually super nice for my Christmas parties, and it was $5, but yeah, I'll keep it throughout the years. And then I got these super beautiful placemats to go along with it. I actually have two kitchen tables, so I can put these in one and the tablecloth in the other to decorate it up. Um, this whole stack was $5. Um, that's not too bad because I know placemats are expensive. Oh my gosh. And it came with a thing that I can put in the center of the table. I didn't know it came with that. That's so cool. And then I got this, um, like shaker thing that you put your mixed drinks in and pour it out the top. I thought this was really cool because it has some recipes on it. Really pretty. And then I got this back massager. Go like that. It's going to feel so good. Oh my gosh. I love back massages. And with that said, that is all that I got. Along with a dog bed for my dog. One of those big, huge, round, like, really comfortable ones. It was $3. Like, usually they're like 30 But I'm not going to show you that because it's in his messy room right now. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. It now looks all messy, but let me know what your favorite thing that I showed you down in the description. I love reading your comments. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe. Bye.